This is Poland. A country is known for beautiful cities, stately castles and diverse geography. As of 2022, Poland is oldier than Portugal for the first time. Not only that, oil refugees bring Poland economic benefit. The economy of Poland is an industrialized mixed economy with a developed market that serves as the sixth largest in the European Union by nominal GDP and fifth largest by purchasing power parity. Before going further, please consider subscribing for your country's economic review. Poland has universal free public health care with no charges for GP visits or hospital treatments and stays, as well as free education including territory education meaning that its citizens pay no tuition fees for studying at bachelor, master's or doctoral level at public universities. And most universities as well as best universities in the country are public. The latest Organization for Economic Cooperation and Development study ranked Poland as the 5th in Europe and 11th in the world for its educational system. Poland is outperforming the UK when it comes to education as well as being the world leader in converting economic growth into the well-being of its citizens, according to a new report. Since 1988, Poland has pursued a policy of economic liberalization. The country is considered by many to be a successful post-communist state. Its economy was the only one in the EU to avoid a recession through the 2007-8 economic downturn. As of 2019, the Polish economy had been growing steadily for 28 years, a record high in the EU. This record was only surpassed by Australia in the world economy. GDP per capita at the purchasing power parity has grown on average by 6% over the last 20 years. The highest in Central Europe, the country increased its GDP sevenfold since 1990. Poland is ranked 25th among 45 countries in the Europe region, and its overall score is below the regional average but above the world. Polish economy gained strength in 2017 and 18, slowed in 2019 and 2020. Growth resumed in 2021. Economic freedom has trended upward over those five years. For decades, Poland's economy has been dominated by three leading industries, agriculture, manufacturing and mining. Even though agriculture and manufacturing still play a significant role in the country's future, they are slowly losing their positions to the newly emerging industries. Poland interacts with Germany and China for its most trade. Poverty in Poland has been relatively stable in the past decades, affecting about 6.5% of the society. In the last decade, there has been a lowering trend as in general, Polish society is becoming wealthier and the economy is enjoying one of the highest growth rates in Europe. In March 2022, the unemployment rate in Poland amounted to 5.4%. Poland offers a high level of salaries, low housing prices, low taxes, compared to other EU countries. And a lot of people are choosing Poland for permanent residence or as the first country to move to Europe. The cost of living in Poland is among the cheapest in the European Union, alongside Romania, Hungary and Bulgaria. In the 2020 Mercer Cost of Living Survey, Warsaw, Poland's most expensive city, ranked 169th out of 209 cities. According to the definition of the International Monetary Fund or IMF, Poland is one of the developing countries because of its lower economic performance, with an Human Development Index or HDI of 0 0.880. But Poland counts as one of the high developed economies by UN definition. Poland's automotive industry is an important manufacturing sector that has become central and Eastern Europe's manufacturing hub for cars, 
car parts and components. Currently, Poland's main export and its economy are focused on agriculture, about 3.1% of Poland's GDP. Textiles, mining and other large industries, about 30% of their GDP. And the most important element, Poland's booming service sector making up 66.5% of Poland's GDP. We are in very last of this video, but do you know, Poland is home to the world's biggest castle and it has one of the world's oldest salt mines. Even vodka originated in Poland.